We made it to McGoran's Beach. Yeah. And it is a beautiful day. I don't think it gets, doesn't get much nicer than that. Ah, uh, the van's not far away. It's only just, you probably see the top of it. Just over behind the dunes. So you pretty much get to camp like right on the beach, which is awesome. Yeah, it'd be nice to stay here. I think we're just going to stay one night. And then, yeah, keep going. Off to the next one. Yeah. Oh, see ya. Good morning. Good morning. We stayed at Port Albert last night just in an RV stop. I think it's like a 24 hour stop and there's some toilets. Um, there's a few vans as well. There was a few this morning um, and last night. Um, we were gonna stay at Reeves Beach last night, but we drove there and it, meh. There was it's heaps, really busy. Yeah, there was heaps of people it there. Really that great. It wasn't, yeah, it was, it wasn't that great. Um, like there was a big, sand dune to get over to the actual beach so it was just like a standard bush camping which is fine I guess but we decided to drive here instead and it was quite nice actually um, the tide's up now it was a bit low yesterday but we went for a walk um, and now we're going to a car oops <laughs> I wasn't filming myself <laughs> ah, now we're going to a caravan park um, big four at Traralagon I don't know how to pronounce it. Um, anyway, we're going there now. So it's supposed to be a really good big four. Um, like there's a high ropes course and there's mini golf and stuff like that within the park. So I'm not sure if they're open all the time or whether it's like a school holidays thing. But anyway, we're gonna go there and we'll see you when we get there. <laughs> morning everybody we are currently at big four at Tralagon. Tralagon. <laughs> I'll um, insert a screenshot because I'm not exactly sure how to pronounce it um, we got here yesterday afternoon and uh, we basically just stay at big fours or well, caravan parks in general when we need to do our washing or if we want to have a really nice shower but yesterday we did get here and we went in the spa which was really nice we tried going in the pool, but it was a bit cold, so we're a bit we're a bit sooky. So we went into the spa instead, um, and then sort of just relaxed in the afternoon. Matt's here cooking up some oh, brekkie. Cooking up a storm. Cooking up a storm, you reckon? Yeah. So we're not sure exactly where we're going today. We do need to pop into the shops um, to buy a few things. Again, yeah. <laughs> we went food shopping yesterday and. Spent two hundred dollars, which is just crazy, but we did that anyway. We just need to pick up a few more things, um, but yeah, we'll update you when we get to wherever we're going. Um, it will be closer to Melbourne because on Thursday we're going to Phillip Island to watch the penguins. I don't know if you can take photos or anything, but I'll see if we can. Um, but yeah, we'll see you when we get to our next spot, I guess. G'day, we've reached our new campsite for the night just outside of, uh, we were calling it Taral, Taralagon. Um, one of the locals were in a shop and he said, what do you say? Taralgon. 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 So we definitely got that one wrong, but oh well. Pretty good little spot, just next to a creek. There's only one other person here, just over there. Um, only bad thing is that it's next to the road, but it shouldn't be too noisy at night time, plus in the vans, really quiet anyway. Um, it's the Jack Richards uh, oh yeah, rest Jeff. area. Yep. We just found it on Wiki Camps. Yeah. So. It's only just out of Tarolgan. <laughs> Tarolgan. 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 Yeah, about half hour. Uh, so. Yeah. We just got all the tech out, charging it up. Yeah, charging things. We took bought, a few photos and we stuff. We bought some... Um, Got a new GoPro. More Pogo, GoPro batteries and battery charger. Yeah. So, yeah. All good. Good morning. Oh, good midday. Good midday, yeah. <laughs> 
Where are we? <laughs> um, we're in Melbourne. We, we made it the city. to Melbourne. Yeah, we can we just, see, just see it over the top of those trees up there. We're just down at Brighton Beach. We just went and had a look at the bather boxes. They're cool, like really colourful boxes, house little house things on the beach. Yeah, they're pretty cool. So, I don't think they don't. I don't think they let you use them anymore. People may own them and go Maybe. down and. I don't know, use them maybe, I don't they're, know. They're all locked up, but if you could use them, it'd be pretty awesome. They all had different you designs and colours. Yeah, they have like That's drawing it, like um, fish all over them and stuff, some of them. <laughs> it's pretty cool. Yes. So we're just exploring Melbourne today. We went to Chadstone Shopping Centre yesterday. It's the biggest shopping centre in Australia. It is. Right? Yeah. That's what, that's what Google said. So we went there. It's pretty cool. We were there for two hours and I reckon we probably what, did half? Yeah, maybe. Maybe half. <laughs> it's, it's a pretty big place. Yeah, so we're just exploring Melbourne today to see what's around because we're almost going to be going over to Tassie, so we're staying close to the port. Um, good morning, everyone. Good morning. We are in Epping. Epping. It's just outside of Melbourne because we're picking up a part for the Mercedes. We've had our first little, what would you say, mechanical problem? First, I guess. Yeah, right. little mechanical problem. The front strut. Front left strut, yeah, it's like leaking a bit. Yeah. And it's getting pretty noisy. Yeah, so. Well, we've got two new ones that I'm picking up. Yeah, so we just. It's a good idea to replace both at the same time. That's right, so we're just going to pick them up now. We're just about to pull into the place. Oh, we got it. This is it here. Exclusive prestige parts. Yeah. So we just called them up uh, the other day and we ordered them and told them that we were going to be in the area today and asked if they could hold them. So it was about $500. Um, and then are we? what are we doing? Are you going to fit them or are we taking it to a mechanic? Uh, I'm not sure yet. Not sure what we're doing. So it might cost more than $500 if we take it to mechanic, but that's all right. But yeah, this is the place here. So hopefully they've got the right ones. Oh, goodness. 
bit rusty, a bit rough this morning. <laughs> it's early. Yeah, we've been enjoying our sleep-ins. We got up this morning a bit earlier and had to make our way to the port to get on the big boat. Just there, the spirit of Tasmania. Uh, we're probably going to end the vlog here and we'll pick it up again uh, with the new, the new adventure. To Tasmania. Yeah, we'll see you next time. See ya. Bye!